Hello everyone, this video I will show you how to integrate the water level sensor to Home Assistant for the automation. So we can see here is the water tank. We will use this for example, and this is case 86 server. And this server, this time, we will integrate with the water level sensor. Here is one kind of water level sensor, and this is another water level sensor. And what is uh, different? And this sensor is output dry contact that it detect the level is on and close just is for high or for low just for one output dry contact and this water level sensor is output analog voltage that is 0 to 5 voltage so that you can learning and you can read the meter how many meter and this this sensor uh, can customer design for many many meters how many meters about 5 meter, 2 meter, 3 meter, almost 20 meter, very, very high uh, distance can be detected. So this is for on and off, uh, not uh, understand how many the meter uh, you have the water tank. This is the first step you need to choose uh, which water level sensor you will use, and the one is the output by contact, uh, just for the contact signal, and the two is the output of the analog out, uh, value so that for 0 to 5 volts and then you can create the automation in home assistant you can see this is the home assistant this time we have used the input one uh, for the water level sensor and we will take this uh, for example and you can see uh, this is a sensor and this have a cable uh, this cable is have four line this have four line that line is v, uh, VCC and ground. That is 12 volt uh, work voltage and the ground. And the output is calm and uh, dry contact output. So this is uh, relay inside. So I can use this sensor uh, just connect with the server. That is for 12 volt and this is ground. And this is uh, also is ground for the output signal. And this is for the input. As, so there are one, two, three, four cables. So now you can see uh, this sensor. When you use, you just uh, stick on the what tank. You can see here is the red, and I have created the automation that the relay four output four is triggered. So you can see home assistant. Uh, this is on. This input one is on, and this uh, relay four is on and you can see i can move this uh, operation you can see here this is for off this is for off and when i move to the quarter it's on and move to this uh, space and it will be off so this what sensor can detect the word in the box this not need to put this sensor to the box inside of the world. But if you use this water level sensor, uh, you need to put this sensor to the world and uh, at the bottom of the world tank. So this is different. Use these two different sensors. And now we can look at how to create the automation for this on and off, on and off to auto country the relay output. So you can see we have the step two uh, we have created these two automation in Home Assistant. That is for what level country output on and what level country output for off. I have already created this on. So we can look at the automation configuration and this here is automation that I have created. Uh, so you can see uh, what is created. This is name and the output is on and the state and the entity is input 1 because I have connect with the input 1 and when input 1 is on just means the triggered, triggered so this is on and then you can see here is call service and the turn on, switch turn on and which output we can choose this one is output 4 so you just create this automation then you, you output 4 will according to the water level sensor so we can create another automation that is for off. So you can see I can create. 
And this is the automation name. I can copy this for save the time. Automation. And also, trackle type is according to the state. And the entity, the import one. So we can choose this one. And this time is off. So we can see here. And the action, you can see, choose the auto call service. And the service is switch because we need to country the switch off. So we need to choose this switch type and the switch will be off. And which switch that choose entity that is output for. So we, when we complete saved and you can back to the this page and just enable this two automation create uh, on and off. So we can go to the overview. And this time, I can turn on this relay 4, and you can see this state. When I have this one, you can see here is on, and the relay is on. And if no work, and the relay is off, also the input state for the first channel is off. So you can see I can here on and off, and on and off. So when you use this time, you can see if you have installed on this this position, and now you can see I have prepared for the word. Uh, we need to let it uh, become what level become high, and then the relay country the relay for is is on. You can see I can. Okay, you can see now the release now. This sensor have detected the word. You can see the black, the black range is a sensor. So this level have touched the black level. So this will be out on. And also, if you have the let the word uh, become high, uh, this time I have moved uh, this sensor up. Uh, you can see uh, this will be off, and this really will be off. So this is how to use the what level sensor to automate country the relay output for your home automation. Okay, thanks for watching.